back to phonics. I saw some of your writing and the things that you found in the long U letter. I wanted to show you what I found. And I know you probably see some of my mistakes. So I want to talk about those really quick. So I found rude use rules, even though it says ooh, no, ooh, tools, I'm going to skip my mistakes, foolish class room, soon school, grew, crew, true, argue, issue, continue, uniform, human, you, manual, student. Now, before I talk about my mistakes, I notice EW, it's at the end of the word, guys, and so is UE. So I wanted to put a note there for myself. Try EU or, I mean, I'm sorry, try EW or UE if you hear long U at the end. I also noticed some patterns. Oon, ool, school, use, refuse, confuse. You can look for patterns and all you would have to do is change the first sound. Patterns are something great to look for. If you hear it at the end of a syllable, you can try you in the word instead of O. Oh. And, of course, you might need to try a couple and choose the one that looks right. Now, boys and girls, as I was looking through Gus's letter, I noticed that there were words that had OO in them. And I just thought to myself, ah, that goes with OO because it's OO, right? Wrong. Tools, foolish, classroom, soon in school. Yeah. Those all say ooh, but good and look, uh, uh, uh. Do those say ooh? No, they don't. It's a different OO sound that says uh, like look, cook, book, good, hood, should, ooh. So those don't say long U sound. Those don't even belong in this manual. So those are things that I found out. Now, in order to use this manual and keep it where we are gonna need it and use it, I think what I could do is put it somewhere where I'm going to use it when I'm writing. So maybe put it where you do your writing at home. That could be helpful, especially using the sorts, okay? Now, after that, I want to show you a new word. I, if you watch the morning meeting, you would know today's word of the day is usually. Now, remember this chart? When we try to spell a word, we need to figure out the troublemaker part first. And how is that going to help us? And then we're going to practice. Okay, we have many different ways. Remember when we were trying to spell friend? F-R-I-E-N-D. <laughs> we made a little rhyme or a song. Write it, write it over and over and over. I know you guys have done that because I've seen your writing and it's beautiful. Take a picture of it in your brain or clap it. Now, usually has how many syllables? Usually. I'm going to write this word. You, and I'm gonna leave that by itself. Shoo, oops. Oh, Lee. You, that says its name. That wouldn't be the tricky part. You, Zhu, Zhu. It kind of sounds like Zhu or Zhu. That is the tricky part. I think. Usually. Okay. So when we're writing words, 
try to find that tricky part and that's going to help you rewrite it. So I want you to use usually in something, oh my goodness, I want you to use usually, I spelled it incorrectly, I'm glad you couldn't see. I want you to use usually in some of your writing today, okay? And keep up the good work. I haven't seen Gus back yet. I hope she gets back in time. Bye, guys. We'll see you soon.